Hi everyone. For today's product review, I'm going to be taking a look at Game Topper's Game Mats by Game Topper's LLC. Like every real gamer, I love playing deep strategic board games. However, they can often go on for too long and everyone has to leave before the game is over. I'd often find myself taking photos of the game so I could recreate the setup at a later date. Or other times, I'd just leave everything out until the next game night, rendering my table completely useless. Both of those options are big inconveniences, and with so many people sharing this problem, the folks over at Game Toppers LLC have come out with these mats to hopefully provide a solution. Game Topper mats are designed to be placed on top of your game, preserving your session while affording you all the surface area a table would normally provide. You're free to eat your meals, draw a drawing, do your work, or anything else you'd usually do on a table. Then, when it's time to start the game again, Remove the mat and pick up right where you left off. The mats are also specifically designed to be stackable. Let's say that while you have a mat covering one game, you decide to play a new game on top of it. If that game takes too long, you can simply cover it with a second mat, preserving them both. If you want to go back to playing your first game while still retaining your second one, the mats are made to be travel friendly. Just roll up the second game, put the mat away, and then roll it back out whenever and wherever you're ready to pick it up again. The mats also come in different styles to accommodate all types of playing environments. If you're playing outdoors on grass, you can cover your game with this green terrain mat to give the illusion of a complete grassy lawn. If you're a cartographer, this parchment map mat will make your stored game blend in perfectly with all your other old maps. Gamers playing in an old cave can preserve the cave's ambiance with this mat and astronauts playing a game in outer space can use this galaxy mat to maintain their view of the solar system. There are tons of different styles available, so kudos to Game Toppers for thinking about the gamers who play games in unique settings. All in all, while these Game Topper mats are a good idea in theory, I'm sad to report that they simply just don't work well at all. When you place a mat on top of a game, even though it has this grip on the back, I found that all the pieces still get shifted around. Also, the surface the mats provide are often bulbous and bumpy, which isn't ideal for most table activities. On top of that, the travel function just plain doesn't work at all. When I showed you the game being rolled back out earlier in the video, I really just took footage of a game being rolled up and played it in reverse. Here's what really happens if you roll out a game. As I said, it doesn't work at all. And sorry about the editing trick there, I just wanted to reward people who stayed until the end of this video with the truth and mislead those who closed it early. Finally, while the different mat styles are a nice gesture, they really weren't thought out well. For example, if you saw this mat on a patch of grass, it wouldn't look like part of the lawn, it would just look dumb. And for this mat, I spoke with many astronauts who told me that, when they play games, it's always inside of their rocket ship, so they'd need a rocket ship interior styled mat, not an outer space styled mat. There is no playing surface that looks like outer space. Also, cartographer isn't even a job anymore, so why are they making a mat that is aimed at that outdated profession? Overall, I applaud game toppers for being innovative, but unfortunately have to hold back on giving them the Dragon's Tomb seal of approval. Hopefully if they release new products in the future, they'll think about things a little more smartly.